Ish by Peter H. Reynolds. Raymond loved to draw. Anytime, anything, anywhere. Ish by Peter H. Reynolds. Raymond loved to draw. Anytime, anything, anywhere. One day, Raymond was drawing a vase of flowers. His brother, Leon, leaned over his shoulder. Leon burst out laughing. What is that? he asked. Raymond could not even answer. He just crumpled up the drawing and threw it across the room. Leon's laughter haunted Raymond. He kept trying to make his drawings look right, but they never did. After many months and many crumpled sheets of paper, Raymond put his pencil down. I'm done. Marisol, his sister, was watching him. What do you want? he snapped. I was watching you draw, she said. Raymond sneered. I'm not drawing. Go away. Marisol ran away, but not before picking up a crumpled sheet of paper. Hey, come back here with that. Raymond raced after Marisol, up the hall and into her room. He was about to yell, but fell silent when he saw his sister's walls. He stared at the crumpled gallery. This is one of my favorites, Marisol said, pointing. That was supposed to be a vase of flowers, Raymond said, but it doesn't look like one. Well, it looks vase-ish, she exclaimed. Vase-ish? Raymond looked closer. Then he studied all the drawings on Marisol's walls and began to see them in a whole new way. They do look ish, he said. Raymond once again drew and drew the world around him, making an ish drawing felt wonderful. He filled his journals, tree-ish, house-ish, boat-ish, afternoon-ish, fish-ish, sun-ish. Raymond realized he could draw ish feelings too, peace-ish, silly-ish, excited-ish. His ish art inspired ish writing. He wasn't sure if he was writing poems, but he knew they were poem-ish. Ponder, 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 dream yonder. Pond, pond, yon, yon, gleam, wander. Raymond. One spring morning, Raymond had a wonderful feeling. It was a feeling that even ish words and ish drawings could not capture. He decided not to capture it. Instead, he simply savored it. And Raymond lived ishfully ever after. If you'd like reading response and social emotional learning activities to go with this book, please click the link below the video. There's also a link to buy the book for a screen free story time. And please like, share, and subscribe for more videos like this one. Thank you for reading with us.